a good trailer, man. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, I'm gonna try to pause this for 350. Oh, there's an RX7 right there. There's an RX7 right there. No. Oh my. going on guys this is rw loki in the flesh you see i got an ad rolling on my own video right now for the new trailer for the next update and um i'm very excited to be disappointed because you know a lot of these updates have been dropping and they come out and half the stuff is broken half the stuff doesn't work you know and uh honestly i've been trying to avoid the hype as much as possible i haven't been watching any content any pictures screenshots this is the first time or the second time since i just now saw this ad but um yeah, so we're gonna do a reaction video to that trailer and uh, give you guys my impressions, my thoughts, my hopes, you know, what I could be excited about. And uh, I'm hoping this one is the big one, man. I'm hoping this one delivers and satisfies and meets the expectations that we know Rockstar can live up to and, uh, you know, improve the game. So let's see how it goes. Welcome to the LS Carby. Don't play that dashboard. We got the fastest cars. Oh, is that the trucks, bro? Okay. Bikes. Oh, all, right. all of it. The only thing we don't got is beef. Mm. Beef. You look familiar. I know you from somewhere. Oh, I just got one in the face. Know. Don't even worry about Body it. Thank you. Oh, man. That was like 130 seconds. What the hell is over? Yeah. Like, we got to pause that up, man. Hold on, hold on. That was, that was exactly what I wanted to see, man. We got the new super in there. Let's see, let's see, we'll run that bag one time. Okay, pause. First off, right? So these cars are drifting really nice right here. There's actually a whole train of cars. There's a whole train of cars right now. And I wanna know, can we actually drift though? Can we actually drift? Are these cars gonna drive like this when we're playing? Because there's all types of trailers and clips you can see on Grand Theft Auto. That Rockstar makes the cars drifting really nicely, but you know, when we get into the game, we can't even turn the traction control off. So that'll be interesting to see uh, how that works. That was a good trailer, man. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, I'm gonna try to pause this for 350. Oh, there's an RX7 right there. There's an RX7 right there. No. Oh my. Hold on, boy. Hold. Hold on, man. So as you guys can tell, I'm a little excited. You know, that was kind of satisfying. Um, you know, a little trailer, a little sneak peek of what we got coming up. Uh, July 20th is when this update is supposed to release. I'm on the Newswire right now. And lots of more interesting things that they are releasing here. It's supposed to be 17 different cars coming out, 17 new cars. Uh, I know I didn't see all of them in the trailer because there is some more in here, man. That RX-7 got me too hyped, bro. I just want to know if it's really going to drift. Like, you can't be releasing, you know, true JDM icons right now, some real drift cars, and have it be like the Drift Tapa, or, you know, have it be like the Super. It can't, you know, clutch kick or anything. And you know they know that the clutch kicking glitch, double clutch, whatever you want to call it, exists, and that's how we drift that as it is. But they could easily add slotty cars, sheet slotty cars, mod, whatever you want to call it, to the game. I mean, they took it out of single player, like it bugged out or something. I'm hoping they were messing with it and, you know, they're going to add it into this update. So we also have what I'm actually more excited about than the RX-7 is the 350Z with no armor. I was just so sad with the 350 that released that had the armor on it. We couldn't take off. So now we have a 350 that's clean with no, you know, bulletproof armor and windows blocked out and all that. So that's going to be great. What else? S2K, Vadinka R3000, Dinka R3000 S2K. So that's gonna be pretty cool. I didn't see that in the trailer. I did not notice. Maybe I have to run that back a couple more times. So I'm scrolling through the news wire right now and there is so much stuff here, man. That's got me excited to jump back into the game. Took a little hiatus, but all this right here, man, has got me playing the game all day. So they're talking about the LS car meet. The LS car meet is like its own separate thing, its own separate arena where basically you can go and have your own private events is the kind of what they're talking about. This supposedly will be able to just go there and there's a test track. And we have, you know, the ability to just get away from everyone and kind of do our own thing. That seems what they're what they're talking about. An LS Car Meet membership. You're gonna have to drop about 50 grand to become an LS Car Meet 
member and you'll get even more privileges. So I'm assuming basically it's gonna be like a thing somewhere off on the map, you know, probably an icon or something. You go there, you get into this warehouse, you won't be able to kill each other or maybe you won't be able to kill anyone who's not in your membership and your team or something like that. But basically what they're bringing is a private area for us to do things, to do car stuff without getting killed. So that's, that's kind of the gist of that. Sounds pretty cool, man. Sounds really good. I'm just curious if the driving physics are going to be different in there, man. I'm, I'm obsessed with that train they just showed in the trailer, bro. If this update isn't about actually drifting nice and not, you know, having to use glitches. I mean, I'm all for double clutching and clutch kicking, but if we don't have to use glitches anymore and we can legitimately just drift these cars, that would be phenomenal. That'd be great, man. So moving on. So there's a lot of free mode challenges. There's a point to point sprint offers a point to point challenge in free mode with up to three three racers three other drivers and a breakneck race from the ls car meet out to various locations like lsia and back so i think they're going to be adding a lot of really cool stuff that is going to actually give you rep reputation you know in free mode so you can set up little things more advanced imprompt races is what i'm what i'm getting from this the street race series you know so basically you have a whole nother layout of imprompt races i'm thinking this is going to be similar to the way you have the ceo similar to the way you have your MCs. Now this is just a car meet, you know, variant of that. So we'll be able to do little mini games in game, which is going to be phenomenal, man. Car meets are about to be fun now, like really seriously fun. You know, a lot more organized. So people won't be as confused. People, some people, you know, take a little bit of time to figure out what's going on for some reason. You know what I mean? But yeah, lots of other opportunities to earn rep. And man, this update is phenomenal, bro. You know, to highlight a couple things, I just think it's really going to be like a our own variant of the MC, our own variant of CEO. You know, this is the car meet update. Will it deliver? Will these cars work? Will the transmissions come through? Are they going to drop this update and break the double clutch again? Are we going to be able to stance our cars anymore? You know what I'm saying? These updates give me anxiety, man. I'm excited to be to be disappointed. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what's about to go down. I'm, 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 I'm happy. I'm sad. I'm, you know, all of that. I'm feeling everything because we already know how it goes, man. Some of these updates break the game for a little bit. And uh, I don't have to tell you guys. You already know, but. That's all I got for you guys today. I appreciate you stopping by to watch and long and uh, see what I had to say. Uh, of course, you know, I'm going to be hosting big time. Check the description. We got links, Instagram, I make posts. Discord has been bubbling and we have a lot of people coming through there. A little bit of activity popping off. And um, yeah, man, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Have you seen Preston?